What is up everybody, Hoosier Pulse here today, and I am so excited because we are taking a look at the brand new AEW Wrestling Cards, first edition by Upper Deck. Uh, I have been wanting to do this review for a really, really long time, um, ever since these were first announced um, back, I think like six or seven months ago. And now, uh, thanks to my buddy Chris from Chris Rips and Reviews, definitely go check out his channel, give him a sub. Uh, he found these in the wild at Target. And uh, he was kind enough to uh, send a box cross country for me. So Chris, thank you, buddy. Would not be making this video uh, if it weren't for you. So definitely uh, the link to his channel is going to be in the description of this video. Uh, I'm, I'm super, super excited. All right, so let's get into it. We get eight cards per pack, eight packs per box. And then here are the odds. There are a ton of different parallels. Um, ton of different inserts canvas cards are really nice uh, and AEW is a fantastic wrestling product overall um, I really enjoy watching it I'm fairly new to it so um, I really really apologize if I butcher any of the names but uh, here we go first pack in let's see what we get thank you so much for joining me today I really appreciate it all right we have Santana we have All Elite Wrestling Magazine. So here's just the uh, the base design. The card is uh, a nice card stock. Doesn't feel too thick or too thin. There's the back. I believe is it a, it's a 100 card base set and then you have these uh, AEW Wrestling Insert Magazines, uh, which is really cool. So we have uh, Rose. Here's a nice MJF. His te technically his rookie card. One of my favorites uh, to watch is MJF. He's a... Uh, Master, master on the mic. Luchasaurus this is a really, really cool gimmick. Uh, really cool mask. Then we have a Arn Anderson. I believe this is the, this is called the Pyro Parallel. So it's a really, really nice uh, firework design. So that's a nice one. Next we have Roads to Success. This is the Cody Rhodes insert. So there's the back there. Really, really already liking the uh, the inserts. Already have gotten three so far. We have Penelope Ford and Lance Archer, who actually uh, was released by WWE a couple years ago and um, kind of molded himself back in the uh, the indies and was signed by AW, and now he's a uh, one of the top-tier talents there, so pretty cool to see. All right, we have SCU, Frankie Kazarian, and Scorpio Sky tag teams here's a nice aw magazine brody lee rest in peace uh he was luke harper in wwe and formed the dark order in aw oh my goodness check this out sammy guevara relic holy cow i'll throw up comps for this um this is this is a great hit this is already a fantastic hit Congratulations, you have received a trading card with Sammy Guevara, AEW memorabilia, memorabilia certified by the Upper Deck Company. So I'm going to sleeve and top load this, and we will be right back. Boom. So first hit, Sammy Guevara relic card. Can't get any better than that. We have Colt Cabana main features. Uh, Colt Cabana uh, spent a lot of time in Ring of Honor, wrestled with uh, CM Punk. If you haven't seen any of Colt Cabana's matches with CM Punk during their early days, I highly recommend you go watch them. They are classics. And then we have Arn Anderson in the back. Holy cow, this is already such an awesome product. Uh, <laughs> I love the design. Um, I haven't opened anything Upper Deck uh, in probably 10 years. So uh, being able to open Upper Deck product is awesome. We have the Young Bucks tag teams. We have Powerhouse Hobbs. There's a big dude. We have the bunny. Nice Chris Jericho main features. And the cards have a really, really nice like gloss to them. Just like a really nice shine. We have main features MJF in the gold. That's a really nice card. I'm definitely going to be sleeving this one. MJF, uh, top tier talent for sure. Billy Gunn. We have, I think that's a Q. Or, yeah, Q, QT Marshall. And then Dr. Britt Baker, um, one of the premier uh, wrestlers in the women's division for AEW. 
Uh, she is fantastic. And I'm pretty sure she's a legitimate dentist. I'm pretty sure she's actually uh, like a real life dentist. So that's pretty cool. Oh man, this pack does not want to be opened. There we go. Definitely looking, uh, already hit one of the, the big names with Sammy Guevara. Um, Kenny Omega is one of my favorite wrestlers, as well as uh, Adam Hangman Page. We got Nyla Rose, Wardlow, Brian Cage, who's, this dude is an absolute animal. Probably one of the best physiques in wrestling. We have Sean Spears, who actually runs his own uh, wrestling school with uh, Tyler Breeze, formerly uh, NXT star Tyler Breeze. So that's a nice main features there. We have a nice gold main features, Matt Hardy. We have a Dustin Rhodes, formerly known as Gold Dust. Really nice Sting, the absolute legend. And then another Sean Spears base. This is a nice card right here. So Sting, AEW Magazine. Sean Spears will go in the base. Oh man, I am having a blast with this. These packs are, uh, these packs are a little rough to open. I'm on the struggle bus a little bit. Here we go. We got uh, the Butcher and the Blade on the back. We have Sheeta. Nice Orange Cassidy AEW Magazine. That's a nice one, Orange Cassidy and uh, Adam Cole just had a great match at the uh, the beach break. We got Chris Jericho base. Here's a nice Colt Cabana. Here's a Lance Archer, one of the pyro, pyro inserts. So that's a nice one. Put that up with the, the Arn Anderson. We have Scorpio Sky, main features. We have Miro. He came from WWE. And here's the Butcher and the Blade tag teams. All right. Still got three packs to go. This has been so awesome. Um, if you would like, please uh, subscribe and hit like on this video if you enjoy my content. We have Nick Jackson, AEW Magazine. We have The Bunny, another base of that. We have Private Party tag teams. That's a cool one right there. We have a red... I don't know what the odds on what the odds on this is, but this is definitely a uh, this is definitely a pretty decent hit right here. We got Ortiz in the red. I'm gonna go ahead and sleeve this up and put that up there as well. All right, so I'm gonna have to look up uh, what this card is uh, actually called, but it's definitely a nice nice sort of red parallel there. We have uh, Ricky Starks for the main features. We have best friends Trent Chuck Taylor tag teams. We have a Chris Statlander base and a Cody Rhodes base. So two more packs left. This has been an awesome product. I'll definitely be getting more in the future. We have Brandy Rhodes, Tony Schiavone. I believe that's how you say his name. We have Taz, an absolute gem on commentary. And another Taz uh, canvas card. So these cards, there's a nice... Hangman. These cards are like a kind of like a matte material. Really nice, uh, nice canvas insert there. Set that to the side. So here's the man, Hangman Adam Page. That's a nice main features right there. Scorpio Sky base, Hangman Adam Page base, and AEW Magazine Brian Cage. All right, getting down to the last pack. Here's another Colt Cabana. We got Taz, Luchasaurus, Christopher Daniels, Santana and Ortiz canvas card. That's a really nice one. We have Dax Harwood main features. Here's a nice AEW wrestling Kenny Omega. And finally we have Ortiz, the last base. All right. That was an absolute blast. I think that definitely the hit of the box is the Sammy Guevara um, certified relic card. This was awesome. I was not expecting um, a hit like that. And then this uh, 
red, kind of like firework parallel of Ortiz, um, as well as this main feature is MJF. Um, I'll throw up comps for all the cards on here, but this was an absolute blast. If you are a wrestling fan and you see this out, definitely scoop it up as fast as you can. Um, this was such, such a fun opening. So again, thanks to Chris from Chris Rips and Reviews for, uh, you know, sending this to me so I could open it for the channel. Thank you so much. Please hit that like and subscribe uh, for more content and we'll see you next time.